Yeah, man. Uh, here we go with uh, Foxy Brown. Now, Foxy Brown has had a rough, rough career. And everybody that, that knows from back in the day know, I mean, it's, it's real difficult with Foxy. It's sad because I really like some of her joints. And I think her third album was probably her best album. The best she's ever made but it's been so many years and to get a little shine at least from somebody like Nicki minaj you would think she would take that and, and try to build with it she would try to do something but apparently you know she gets on stage uh from what i out of here wearing a mask yeah she had a mask on man i i, I don't know mask with shades on like i don't know what the fuck she was thinking DJ pulled off the stage and, you know what I'm saying, DJ was like, Candy like said something to her on the way out, maybe like, you know, girl, you got to take that mask off or something, you know what I'm saying? Do you and think it's the Candy- reason why she had on a mask, though? Do you think that maybe she got into an incident, maybe something happened to her, and so she put on a mask to cover <laughs> that up? I, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? If she got into the incident, maybe she shouldn't have hit the stage. And then Candy came back and tried to cover up like, you got to respect my girl. Let her take the mask off. No, you should never went on there with that mask on. Like that was that was consistent booze for like four minutes. Like it, it was bad. It looked like amateur night or something at, at Apollo. Mm. I mean, all they were missing was the Sandman. The Sandman and the King. You got to hey, you, you, you get out of here. It was bad. Well, apparently she had been late, which is weird for her to be late for something like this. When somebody gives her a shot, the fans were waiting. Uh, yeah, you, she got to know you can't, you ain't Jay. You can't be late like that. You know what I'm saying? Now, fans sit there and be wait, patiently waiting on somebody like Jay, but you know what I'm saying? Like, you, come on, Fox, you got to be better than well, that. Well, why, why did you feel that Jay, like, you, uh, you said something about, uh, maybe she should have came out with Jay Z or something like that. Are you serious? Yeah, I mean, but I'm saying I, I'm thinking like you know what I'm saying. You said they were cool, right? They uh, they course, weren't on. Of course, they used to be cool. I mean, I don't know where they at now. You know, it's been some years. But I mean, but I'm, I'm just saying she should have came out with Jay or Case or somebody. You know what I'm wow. saying? You, you, case or you know maybe think case, about it. Case wait, wait, wait. Okay, now you want to now you want to say Case. Man. Now you want to say case now because you probably didn't thought about it now. Like, why would Jay Z come out to, <laughs> to this, this event, man? What's wrong with you, man? <laughs> now you want to switch it to case now. <laughs> well, I, I mean, Jay obsolete from some of these events, man. You know what I'm saying? But no case no, now, you know? Maybe, no. maybe throw an RB legend in there, like a case of somebody, like, you know, you're the only one for me. You know, man. Maybe the guy. <laughs> You know, the girl would have felt a star for him and a star for him, but like, oh, she did come out with Kate, so let you know we we gotta we we need to spare the booing a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Nah, Jay Jay ain't gonna be in the middle of all this, man. He ain't gonna be in the middle of all this. This ain't his thing, Yo, man. Fossey, you gotta take the shades off, Fossey. <laughs> yeah. Nah, she had on a mask though, man. Like maybe it's I'm thinking maybe she was trying to hide something. Maybe she was covering something. She could have gotten into an incident that had her angry when she got there. Maybe she should have canceled. I don't know. Well, I mean, who, I'm like, who is her manager, though? You know what I'm saying? Who, who would let the manager be like, you know, suggested like, man, you, you, you can't go out there like that. Or, you know what I'm saying? Just, let's just, you know what I'm saying, reschedule this thing or something. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to tell you like this. I think that this is my guess out, out of everything throughout the years that's happened. Uh, I know a lot of the drama with, you know, Foxy Brown and all that throughout her career. But I think in this case, there may be something else to it. Just in this case, there may be something extra to that situation on why all of that took place like it did. I think uh, one, at one time, once she having problems with her ears or something, like maybe she didn't hear the booze. You know what I'm saying? Cause, I mean, because she was up there performing like, you know, she didn't hear the booze and you know what I'm saying? Like. I think I thought she had that fixed, but uh, and I could be wrong. Well, apparently, she had it fixed in all these years. I, you know, I, I thought so too. But you know, according to last night, maybe not. Maybe like, she could have she could have got the crowd back on. Maybe, but I think part of it also was not only that, but when she got on stage, she you could tell that she kind of lacked what she was supposed to be doing as far as her music goes. In today's situation with music. 
a lot of people now get on stage with the, the whole entire track playing behind them because right. especially I think that's that's probably good for older rappers, but I'm not saying that's good across the board. Uh, you know, that's a little controversial. I don't I just don't agree with all of it, but it is what it is. So that's what they're doing today. So <laughs> maybe she don't remember her words, which I can understand that. But it was a bit off, though, man. Even even with the track behind, it was still off. It was like, like I said before, if you're going to come to your, your, your show, your concert, whatever, and you're just going to play your whole entire track, what's the point? What's the point of being on stage if you're just going to play the music that they could play at the house? They could do that at the house. They could play the same track loud as hell at the house. Probably won't have that reverb or whatever, but it's the same track, though. So I, I don't know no we playing Foxy Brown at home, you know what I'm saying? Well, like I said before, man, her third album was great. Um I was actually surprised by that album, even though that was like in two thousand one. Uh, but that's still her wow. best work in my opinion. Wow. Eighteen years ago. Are you are you serious? Yep. I mean Yep. <clears throat> that was her best work in my opinion, and and I guess that's that, you know. Uh I think she probably should have came out to some of those songs on stage, but it really didn't matter because she wasn't she even ready. She wasn't her ready best, anyway. Her best track, her best track was, was with Case. She should have came out with Case. I disagree Somebody with that, Case man. Now you, now you way back, man. Like <laughs> you going Case could have saved, Case, Case could have saved her, man. That's not Case her best track, her. man. No, that's well, not. you know, it's her best known track. Nah, I disagree. Well, I'm saying, you know, if they want to throw that R and B twist in there, maybe Case could have, you know what I'm saying? Case could have came in and say it like, you know, Case could have came out singing his part, you're the only one for me. And then brought Foxy in, you know what I'm saying? And then boom, it it's probably would have been more smooth, you know what I'm no, saying? It still would have been the same, bro. It still would have been the same. <laughs> they wouldn't have booed Case, uh, man. Them 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 ladies that would they wouldn't have booed Case. They probably wouldn't have booed Case, but they probably would have booed Foxy for being late. Because that's the whole thing anyway. First of all, she was late. Second of all, she wasn't coordinated with her song. So, hey, man, look, man. And it's then, sad because you know, I, I kind of like Foxy Brown, but nah, that, 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 you just got to stop doing that in, in, in this time, you know what I'm saying? This period in your yeah. career. You should be trying to revamp or revitalize, especially for a new era, a new generation of people. And instead, even even just a, even just the generation that came up with the music, you know, you got to want to come out here proper with it. And instead, I mean, you dropped the ball. So I don't think she was missing with a stick because, uh, you know, maybe she did have prior incident because not only did it seem like she didn't hit a booze, but it, DJ had to escort off like she was blind. Like I, she was just missing that, that stick, that blind stick, you know. Maybe they should have put the words on the braille or something. I don't know. On the on the big screen or something, if they had a screen in the back. Maybe they should have put them up in Brett Leatherfield or words or something. I don't know. She looked nah, blind. Nah, nah. Nah. Just a bad situation overall, man. Hey, uh, when you have a moment like that, you should take great advantage of it. So again, for something like that to happen, I think there was something prior. It has to be. It just it doesn't make any sense. This many years, like. You you get your chance to come out here and do you know do your thing and you do this so it has to be something that happened before that I don't even think everybody knows the full story there has to be something extra to this you know something has to be extra to this you know that's what right. I right. Right. I mean what how, how did they receive her when um, she came out with Minaj well it's Nicki Minaj I mean Nicki Minaj introduced her brought her out you know what i'm saying so um that went a bit differently they didn't receive no booze no okay so uh, outside of that she hadn't done any stage work since or nobody seen her on i stage. haven't I, seen anything i haven't seen anything from foxy brown and, and i could have missed something but i haven't seen okay not take that back she i think she has tried to do a couple of small joints i remember there was one uh where her top was coming off of her and so she couldn't really perform 
like she started performing she started getting all hype with it or whatever like that but then you know her top started coming down and uh they kept trying to cover her up and hold them up and uh <laughs> so they just you know she couldn't do it but uh yeah other than that no i haven't seen much from her since then this is it man this is all bad man all bad yep Gather the grind comes the grind.